in today's video I'm going to show you guys how I started my YouTube channel in the simplest way you guys can start a YouTube channel without spending a lot of money so the first step is is to come up with an area that you're going to shoot your videos in most of the time which is I'm in my spare bedroom right now and that's where I shoot my videos sometimes well where I'm going to be shooting them is in the spare bedroom closet so once you have that spot picked out you're going to want to um I'm going to close the door because it's loud but the door doesn't really close but now that you're in here you're going to find a place to set up your um find a place to set up your camera so in my closet in here there's just like a bunch of boxes and stuff and there are these things i honestly don't know what they are but they're great to like set your phone on and, oops what i just do is i sit right there on the boxes like that and then i just put my phone on it okay so her clothes right there okay so if you want this step is optional but also in your YouTube room you can have a light I had a light right here but it's plugged up like far away and I couldn't close the door if I had the lamp and plus it didn't even fit so that's pretty much all you need for the YouTube room. And then if you want, you can put a simple way to have a backdrop in your video is to take a, what do you call it? A poster board and just put it on the wall or on the door or whatever you're sitting behind. So now I'm going to show you my the apps that I use for my YouTube channel and what I use to film my intro and outro and I'm going to start screen recording. So now that it's screen recording, these are the apps that I use. I use Intro Maker, Vlogstar, and YouTube Studio. Now I'm going to show you guys how to use those apps. So first for Intro Maker, this is just an app how you make your intros so you're going to pick out a template that you want and I'm going to use this template and then you're going to download whatever size you want I'm going to pick this one and you're going to wait for it to download and then you're just going to play it and watch it. And now you're going to, when it says subtitle, you're going to want to pause it and then add your subtitle. So for mine, mine is just... So normally it's just the name of your YouTube channel. So this one kind of looks weird. But Okay, I'm going to pick a different um a different um what do you call it? A different a different template okay so I'm gonna pick this one and gonna just watch it again and then
you can you can type your subtitle or just your title and that's what mine looks like then once you type it you can pick like a different font so I'm gonna pick this one and then you can hit design to change like the way the words look so I like this one and you can also change colors so then those are just different ways that the words come in so I like this one and then you hit done once you're happy with that and then you can just delete the extra ones that you didn't use and the way you delete them well you can't really delete them oops but what you can do is you can go like that or you can just click it and you can oh you can hit the trash can okay to delete that subtitle and then you can also delete the other ones that you're not using if you have extra ones so there now you can play it and see what it looks like now you can add music so to add music you hit the music button right there and then you pick whatever type of like music you want so I like to use these ones <laughs> to your song or to your intro so now you can just play it make sure the volume and stuff is right for you and then you can hit the plus or the check mark and you can also add like pictures and things like that Let's add this one. This one. Okay. So. So I'm not actually going to save that. But to save, you hit the check mark in the top. So, I don't need to save that, but those do not need to be saved. So, now I'm going to show you guys how to use the other apps. So now, YouTube Studio is basically just how you get like your notifications and stuff for your YouTube channel. So, you can just mess around with that. I don't really know how to use this app as much as I do with the other ones, but now I'm gonna show you guys how to use Vlogstar. But before you use Vlogstar, you're gonna wanna just create a normal video that you want for your video, or that like your video is going to be about so i'm just going to do a simple one hey guys oops it doesn't work because i'm already screen recording but you just basically create a video and then you go to vlogstar and you Hit start new project and then click which ratio rate. I don't know how to say it, but click which one you want and then you hit the plus sign and then you can add videos that you want. So I'm gonna add one of my TikTok videos 
and you can select however many videos you want so now hit add once you have all the videos you want and then you're gonna play it this is my age this is my height this is my favorite color this is my sign this is my inspiration and then this is just my hit favorite next game. video but this is how you like basically you can cut out however much you want and things like that so then you can hit next video and then just put however much of that video you want so that's how much I want so now you hit done and then you can hold if you want the videos in a different order you can hold the video like you can long press long press it and then move it just like that and then hit the, hit the check mark then hit export and wait for it to export and do not switch tabs because it will mess it up and you'll have to do it again so now this is how I made my video. This is my age. This is my height. This is my favorite color. This is my sign. Okay. Now you can hit home. And that will be added to your projects. So, that's the project I just made today. And now that is it for the apps i i think now i'm just going to show you guys how to add it on youtube which is very simple but some people may not know so you're going to go to the youtube app open up the youtube app and then you're going to click on the little icon at the top and then hit your channel and then you can hit this little video camera at the top. And you can pick whatever video you want to um you want to add to your YouTube channel. So this is the one that I just made. So you can <laughs> This is my age. And then you can title it whatever you want. You can add a description. But then once you're done, you're going to hit upload. But I do not want to upload it because that's just not what I want to do. So now you're going to. Now I'm gonna go back to my regular camera. So hope, so hopefully the screen recording worked, but I don't really know. But now the only two steps left is to be creative and have like creative ideas and to creative ideas to make videos and things like that. And then you need, well, actually three things. You need to post often. So, like, don't post, like, every, don't post, like, once a year or, like, once a month. Maybe just at least two times, just at least one time every two weeks. And then the last step is to just have fun with your videos. And, yeah, that's pretty much it. So, I hope you guys liked it and hopefully you can decide to start your own youtube channel and um also comment down below video ideas so i can make sure i'm posting so 